Hey guys, what's going on? It is Castle Perfect here today, bringing you a little tutorial on how to get Hydreigon in Pokemon X and Y. I just recently heard that you can get this Pokemon fully evolved at level like 59 or something, and I was very curious about how you get it exactly, because on Serapid.net, it says it's a special Pokemon, and it doesn't even show just what the rate is of finding this Pokemon, so I was searching on YouTube just for a specific explanation on how to get it and I just couldn't find a single video about it but then I changed like the uh, search terms that I was using and I found a sing as you know I found a video which was you know relatively well done and uh, I was like you know I need to remake this in a better quality because that video was really really blurry and stuff so this is what it's going to be now first uh, if you want to go ahead and fly to um, what's this city called to Santa Loon City, that's exactly where I'm where I'm at at this point. You wanna go there, and uh, you wanna use your bike obviously to get there quicker. You go all the way to Route 22, or Route 22, sorry, and you go all the way to the right, all the way here, and uh, you just basically take the same path. That you would normally take to go through the uh, to, to to get to the Elite Four, and that is basically the Victory Road. I want to go all the way up here, and uh, the reason being for why I told you guys to get through this place, uh, you can get also through a different method, of course. You know, flying straight to the Elite Four, um, and then just go from there. But then you'll have to use surf and stuff like that, and uh, this way you can pretty much avoid it. So I'm actually going to. See if I can get a max repel going on somewhere. Alright, the M is over here. Max repel. So that wild Pokemon will not get in our way. So, uh, one thing, by the way, is that the camera is kind of blurry. I hope you guys can still see it, though. Uh, it's because I'm recording with my phone. And uh, it just doesn't focus the screen. It doesn't focus on the screen right now. And I don't know why because I'm in a cave but you guys can clearly see which path I'm taking I'm gonna go all the way up here to the right and now you get outside and this is where you need to be now thank god the camera just decided to focus so this is the place exactly right here is where you can get Hydreigon, Skarmory and Fero. Fero is the Pokemon that you'll be most likely be coming across all the time but uh, sometimes you get to see Skarmory and sometimes sometimes very very rare occasions you get to see Hydreigon now all you have to do is go around here and wait until a black spot like that appears and you go to that spot and a Pokemon just flies down there and it can be a Hydreigon it can be a Fero in most cases of course like I said it is going to be a Fero which is quite unfortunate most people would like to see something else but yeah it's, it's just like that so uh, Fear over here, I don't know, again, why the camera is not really focusing, can help it right now, ladies and gents, um, I'm sorry, I'm just gonna run, and to repeat this process, you'll have to repeat this process quite a lot of times, in order to get the Pokemon, so you, all, you, all you have to do is get it inside the cave here, or the other side where we came from before, get out again, go up there one more time, and you know, do the exact same thing, Another Pokemon will fly down, and if we have luck this time on our side, it will be a Hydreigon, which it's not. It's one, once again a Fero. I'm going to continue doing this. You want to continue doing this until you find the Hydreigon that you are looking for. Now remember, Hydreigon at level 55 or 59, sorry, is very powerful. It knows the moves um, Body Slam, Work Up, Dragon Rush, and something else. I think it's Scary Face. Alright, here's another one. Let's see. Alright, so see, that's in Skarmory. Like I said, you can find three different Pokemons here. Or Pokemon, sorry. Uh, it's Skarmory, which is uh, the middle uh, middle rarest Pokemon. And the rarest of them all is the Hydreigon. So once again, like I said, it, it is really tough. Sometimes you can find the Hydreigon in just one run. Sometimes it can take so many tries, it can actually make you want to give up. I just found like two Hydreigons a couple of minutes ago, really. 
All right, sometimes you don't even get to see a single Pokemon, so you'll just have to go back into the cave and get out. And repeat the same process. Just like I'm telling you guys, this is all you have to do. Just go around this rock right here, and uh, that's about it. Blueberry jump. Does Amsterdam have the best weed in the world or what? Oh shit. Are you serious, nigga? Let's oh. the real weed song. Let's go. The weed in Amsterdam is the best, says Ludacris. Oh, and there it is. There it is. Once I talk about weed and stuff, High Dragon shows up. Let's get high. <laughs> Alright, so guys, this is the Hydreigon C. See it for yourself. There it is on the screen. It took me like 60 or 70 encounters to find it. It was ludicrous. But I did find it. And um, basically, instead of catching it, I'm going to fucking murder it. Because this goddamn noob wasted so much of my time, I can't take it. See, die, please. Thank you for participating. <laughs> and that is, ladies and gents, how you get a Hydreigon in Pokemon X and Y. It is a pain in the ass to get, but you do get it. And at the end, it looks like this. Yes, I already had one in the party that I caught here. This one has Levitate, has Nature, uh, Brave. It was caught in Victory Road level 59, and it looks like this. And it knows the moves by the way, Work Up, Dragon Rush, Body Slam, and Scary Face. So that's about it guys, thank you very much for watching, I hope it helped out, and uh, enjoy your Hydreigon, or the hunt behind it. See ya!